What's up guys, Mungo Talent here, aka Paul, aka whatever you want. And today we're going to talk about uh, moonwalking. Now every time I make a video someone always like, oh, how do I moonwalk with X character? Or how do I moonwalk? I'm like, we'll go watch my other videos. Um, but today we're going to address the how to moonwalk with other characters. But first, we'll do it with uh, Falcon. Now notice when Falcon moonwalks, I always do it from a dash dance. And then I just repeat the motion of left to right as fast as possible without going through the center. Fairly straightforward. But not all characters can do it from a dash dance. Falco, for instance, or sorry, Fox, for instance, cannot do it from a dash dance. If he tries, he ends up just. I don't know that. There we go. If he tries, he simply stops or runs backwards. It doesn't work. And that's because Fox can only do it from a walk. Anyone who can walk really fast tends to have quite a good walk out of a walk. So you can walk and. Oh, that's a PC drop. Uh, you can walk and. Oh my god, why can't I do it? And walk, there. walk and boom, walk like that. Fairly straightforward. Um, nothing more complicated than what I've done before except adding a forward motion at the very start. So I've got Fox moving and then boom, walking to the end. Fairly straightforward. You can do it and get some serious range like that. I know if uh, Mango likes to use it in that manner as opposed to grabbing the edge. If I was a fox, I'd do it all the time as well, but it has its uses. You can get to the edge. It's probably not as quick as going. Oh crap. Probably not as quick as going to the edge like that. However, yeah, it does look pretty swag. And there's, there's probably got to be a better use of it. So there you go. Uh, with Falco, Falco can do it as well. Falco, um, obviously, the slower version of Fox and therefore has a worse moonwalk as well. It's not particularly good, um, but it can grab the edge and it can get some serious range and go quite far on Yoshi's. Uh, not much to say really, the fact that you can get that far out backwards with a back air is good for a, say, a, a falcon recovering very high, etc. I know it annoys me when people... Uh, can reach that far. Uh, they tend not to do it with the nair, it's quite risky, but they do it quite often with the back air, stronger as well, so I gave them that. Uh, Marth can do it as well. Again, Marth cannot do it from a dash dance. Marth tends to do his uh, from a walk as well. His, can do, his is really far though, which is quite nice, so he can get some serious range on that move walk. Notice as well that I'm just fast falling to grab the ledge quickly as well with Marth, otherwise you end up wasting a lot of time grabbing a ledge like that. Uh, I guess you could come off aerial as well, but I don't know. The fact that Marth's aerial turns around already is probably more than enough. So again, Marth does it really well as well. Uh, all the characters I've shown you so far, they can do it from a dash dance or walk. Uh, Gallon can, but it just doesn't get very far. Similarly, from a walk, you can get a little bit of range. But Ganon uh, mainly gets most of his range from a perfect waveland into a moonwalk. And I can never do these on, on demand. Biz can. Biz is too pro. And there we go. Ah, oh, died. So, um, Ganon likes to do his from a perfect moonwalk, perfect waveland, sorry. He gets quite far with his, with his uh, moonwalk. I don't think it has any practical use. But then again, no one actually uses Ganon for practical use anyway, they use him for swagging. So you can just add, add more swaggy moves to your uh, repertoire. There we go. You can do it backwards as well. I'm not particularly good at doing it backwards, but that's how Biz does his. So I guess you probably follow what he says. But there you go. Anyway, guys, that's how you do the. Um, that's how you do moonwalking with a bunch of other characters. Uh, let me know how you feel about this this new layout I've got with me up here, the pad pipe down there, the game to the side of me somewhere. Do you like it? Do you prefer it? Is it better? Is it worse? Um, honestly, I prefer it because it's a lot, lot quicker uh, to put out videos. It means I can get one a week out. I can do it while streaming and just crop, copy and paste and cut bits out here and there and make them into a video and archive them on YouTube forever. 
Um, but then again, some people like the fact that I had my hands there. Do you prefer it with a bigger camera or a smaller camera at the game screen as well? You let me know. And most of all, uh, thank you very much for watching. If you liked it, give it a like. If you disliked it, give it a dislike. And most of all, please subscribe if you haven't already. I'm getting close to that 1,000. It'd be quite nice to hit 1,000. Never thought I'd be there. So, yeah. Thank you very much for watching, guys. And hopefully, I'll see you soon.